Hi parents, hope you're well and had a good break. This is a video to help you find the um, location of anything that you need on school books if you're helping your kids um, with any of the work and just seeing what they're up to um, in general as well. So um, I have uh, uh, streamlined and simplified all of the places that the kids will need to go for anything. The very first place they go in the morning is just to their homeroom page. And um, here is where they go just for the devotions. Uh, that was from uh, the uh, just before the holidays. Um, their devotion video will appear up here and then they'll be able to post um, their response here. So I'll ask something in the video, um, some sort of question or um, discussion um, topic, and then they will just post their comments under there. So that's where they go for devotions. And then if there are any announcements, they can check this news box over here. So that's where the, they go for um, the start of the day um, and the email attachment with the online learning timetable um, will have structure for them um, about when to go there. Then after that, um, the English will be the next thing on their timetable. And this is where it is now really streamlined. So they only have to go to one place to find the teaching video, um, find the instructions, submit their work and see feedback all in the one place. It's all in these little containers over here um, where a new one will come up each week. So this is the one for this week. And it has all of their instructions for the day in each task. So for example, tomorrow they'll see this um, writing task for them to do. They'll create their submission here. And this is where we will give them as teachers the feedback on how they went. And then, um, according to their timetable, later in the day, they'll go to their literacy skill. So everything that they need, all the instructions will be in the one place. So everything is within this container um, on the English page. So hopefully that's um, a lot easier to navigate. You might notice when you go into here and you'll see the due dates and due times, that's as a reminder for them and it will pop up as a notification for them that something is due in five minutes or when it's overdue. So according to the school, the online learning timetable that we are working with at the moment, this is usually the time where I'd hope the kids would have their um, certain uh, work in. Um, so the writing task, if it could be done by 11, that way I can start giving feedback and posting it. Um, and this literacy skill handwriting is just one to tick off because there's nothing to submit for that one. So they can tick the box there and go back just to keep track of the work themselves. Um, and then the next day on Thursday, when they start to apply the writing feedback from yesterday, um, I'd like them to do that first. So that's why it's in this list first. So they can actually see the feedback and apply it and then be ready for the next task um, that will build on that. Um, so if you're looking for any overdue work that your child might have, anything they might have missed, if you look in their notifications, the words that will come up, it'll say such and such task is now overdue. Um, so you can look through all of those tasks to see if anything's missing. Uh, if your child is finding that there is too much work to do, just let me know and we can definitely arrange something different and we can cut down their workload because I know it is quite a lot of um, self-management and time management working from home without a teacher with them all the time. So please just let me know if you need anything uh, like that. Um, and then if a child has any questions, they can just go back to the main English page. And in the forum, they can post their question. Um, and I'm getting them to post the question as the title. So that if anyone has the same question, they can see the answer there um, and not have to ask it twice. Um, something the kids might have told you about is the social stream. So there's no social stream on the English page. All the questions go to the forum, not on the social stream. Um, on the homeroom page, the social stream and the forum are just for chatting and staying connected with each other, um, which is good. So I hope that gives you some insight into where the kids will be going and the sort of work they'll be doing. Um, this course outline is where they're going to look for everything and all the containers, these project containers will have all of the work with the instructions, the videos, where they submit and their feedback all in the one place. Um, yeah, so just email back if you have any questions. And I uh, hope it all goes well tomorrow. Uh, just let me know if you need anything. Thanks. Bye.